Hi everyone, this is my new channel. Uh, I started it a while ago and then didn't put any uh, content on it. And now I have switched my main channel. And now this is for my uh, woodworking and my DIYs. And I'll put my other channel in link in the description box. So here this, you can see, this is a wood round from the Dollar Tree and I just flipped it over and I am painting it white um, with Waverly's chalk paint in the color snow. And I sat it to the side and grabbed this little, uh, I guess it's a picture holder, but I'm going to be making it into a trellis, sort of. So I'm just taking all of the, the stuff off the, uh, the stand, the little clippy thing, and I'm going to grab that same Waverly uh, chalk paint in snow, and I'm going to use a, uh, a stipple brush, and I'm going to dry erase um, this window. And then I'm going to grab that little crate, and I'm going to use uh, the chalk paint in nautical, and I'm going to paint that. And then we'll see what I end up doing. This little rolling pin is from Woodpecker Crafts, and I'm coloring, I'm painting the handles with the nautical, and then we'll come back to that as it dries. So here I am just sticking this all together, and this is a foam from the Dollar Tree, and I am put that in there, and then I grabbed two or three picks from the Dollar Tree, and I'm going to put this. in here now this all this little project came to be about let's see one two five dollars exactly the other one was only uh maybe 80 cents so yeah i'm doing okay on the the money situation so and i ended up put, making a little bow it's just a little piece of ribbon that i had and uh, i had some little scatters star scatters and I've had them for a couple of years. I only had like four or five left. Uh, maybe a little bit more. Um, for out of two packages. So I just put that on there.
And here is the final reveal for this one. And now for the information about the five under five, the hosts are Emily from Farm Charm Chic and Missy from The Crafty Cove. Their guest host is Marla from The Chic Show. The Chic Show. Boy, I cannot say those words. But this is their um, five under five. So you want five things each one under five dollars but the playlist will be down in my description box so let's get right back into this all right so i am taking this uh white and red checkered tissue paper and i'm just going to use um uh mod podge and i'm just going to put that on there and then this project will be done and then we will move on to the next one now this, of course, is just a simple little project, and here's the final reveal. Now let's get to the next project. Okay, so um, I am just going, I pulled out the, uh, the wood round I had painted in the white, and I'm putting a piece of tape on it, and I'm going to paint um, the top blue, and then I'm going to work on the rest of it. Okay, I took this uh, napkins that I got from the Dollar Tree, and I'm going to cut it and splice the pieces together with the red and white stripe to put on the um, bottom of this wood round. And so, and I'm just using Mod Podge to do that. These are ribbons that I got from the Dollar Tree, and I'm just making a real simple little bow to go on the top of that wood round. And then um, I'm going to use another one of those scatters. And I'm not sure, I think I showed where I fixed the um, A on the USA. Oh, wait, I haven't done that yet. Never mind. Ooh. Okay, you'll see it. Just going to glue this all together okay so you can see I put a jute holder and I'm gluing this with hot glue and then I'm grab that scatter um, and I'm going to put it right there then I'm going to grab my um, red chalk paint and I am going to paint the word or the letters USA and you can see right now I messed up I put the A in the middle and then I'm going to put the the U and the S and then I paint over the A and put um the S in the center because it's USA of course so that is what I ended up doing I know I messed up now this project ended up being um Oh, maybe two, a dollar and a half, maybe. Oh, two dollars, maybe. So, that's good, good price. So, I'm going to uh, just finish this. Of course, after this red is dried, then I'm going to put, uh, use the nautical blue and go around the edges. And then I'm going to grab some baker's twine in the red and white and put it right across 
the um, where the tissue paper is, and then I'm going to put three scatters on the blue underneath the bowl. So here I have got um, the uh, candlestick holders. I covered them with Mod Podge and then I sat them to dry and then I moved back on to one of the other projects to work on. I know I'm going back and forth, back and forth, but that's kind of how it ends up, ended up being. Here's a yard sign of a gnome from the Dollar Tree. And I'm just going to uh, revitalize it into a red, white, and blue. So I am painting the whole beard white. Then I'm going to paint the hat red and the shoes blue. Then I'm going to put a star on it and a scatter. And I'm going to call this finished. So I hope you enjoy. Hope you guys enjoy and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and give me a big thumbs up of course um, this is a new uh, sort of new channel so yeah I want to hopefully see everybody there or here in this channel hope you guys really enjoy this plus my um, other channels link will be in the description box please take a look I've turned it into my art channel um, I only do paintings um, there, and I hope you guys enjoy it. So, yes, hope you like all these. These are all $5 or under um, to go along with the 505. You want to check out the playlist. Got some amazing uh, crafters on in the playlist. As you can see, I am painting these uh, candlesticks with red and blue. Then I'm going to put white scatter stars glued to it and then um, using this really dense foam I'm going to uh, glue to the top and then I'm going to sit uh, little white um, lanterns from the Dollar Tree on top of it and I'm going to call those done and good so I hope you guys enjoyed all of these projects.
here is the final reveals of all three of the are all five of the projects like i said before i hope you enjoy call somebody and check in on them our youth especially is hurting they need to you just need to ask them how are you what can i do for you and just be there for them also have a blessed week and don't forget to be the bible that somebody reads today bye